We right back this time doing a remix of Incomplete Darkness, classic hardcore track by the Fat Controller. You remember the Slipmat and Nucky remixes? Insane, absolute anthem, hands in the air business. If you didn't know, samples from this track, which is Rolo Goes Camping, it was a house track back in '93, I think. So yeah, just check the samples here. And then it's got the piano piece. So the first thing I wanted to do when approaching it was trying to find different bits in the original to see if there was anything else I could sample to kind of make a little bit of a variant in the remix. So I found this bit which I thought would be wicked for an intro. <laughs> I also found this little piece after the main strings, which is an organ part. Now, I was looking for different samples for the Incomplete Darkness. There's the Janet Jackson bit, but I was thinking maybe is there something else I can find and came across this audio book. The Dr. Millant ladies alike had quitted their beds and was demanded confusedly on all hands. But for the moonlight, they would have been in complete darkness. Are you mad? So, um, of course I sampled that, but for the moonlight, we would have been in complete darkness. I wanted to learn the piano riff so I could layer it within the samples to make for a thicker sound. So, here we go. <laughs> Some drums out of the Amiga giving an 8 bit roughness. Check this out. Use a little bit of the TB303 from 1981. Also, did a few little cuts in the track using this vocal here. I'm a sucker for pitched up rap vocals, so I used this one. Obviously, you got this as well. In complete darkness, we are all the same. You've also got the Frankie Goes to Hollywood sample. <laughs> Used a phaser effect on some of the synths from the quad core. There's a tiny bit of bit crushing going on on some of the drums on the auxiliary, also off the desk. Also added some parts from the 707, a few of the little synth bits, and lots of drums off the 1100 Akai. Then started the idea with a little bit in the Amiga, and then stemmed it all out into Ableton. And so here's the test press. It's been done on 10 inch. It's got my remix on one side, and the original 93 version on the other side. You can get this vinyl now from Fat Controller. And don't forget to check out the outro with me on the guest vocals, yeah? So, yeah, here we go. My remix of Incomplete Darkness. Big shout going out to Fat Controller. Here we go. the moonlight they would have been in complete darkness. But for the moonlight they would have been in complete darkness.
complete darkness. In complete darkness, we are all the same. It is only our knowledge and wisdom that separates us.